UAE is the fifth largest country that has the largest reserves, abundance of the natural gas resource. We have all the necessary network and infrastructure to transport this natural gas all over the UAE. So it's conveniently available as well. Our uh, partnership with Power started in uh, early 2009, where we have had an agreement with them to uh, construct 16 uh, NGV stations. That is phase one, basically. That is the initial uh, project that we had with them. Tankstelle dann alles alles Gute und hoffentlich gibt es bald fast nur noch Erdgastaxis und Erdgasbusse in Abu Dhabi. And across this experience on the 16 stations, Power has been successful in implementing uh, the project on time and as per the agreed uh, cost and also they maintained the quality aspects as well as uh, they kept the uh, the uh, rate of uh, accidents incidents and lost time injuries to zero power has been a very good contractor to us on uh, this ngv projects UE is taking the lead into diversifying into a cleaner and more sustainable and safer sources of energy. The public transport are now converted to natural gas. 2009, a decree has been issued by the uh, Executive Council of the uh, Emirate of Abu Dhabi 25% of all government and public transports need to be converted to natural gas. We have been working with the government entities as well as the public entities as well for the convergence. Was man aus dem Markt sieht und auch in der Praxis umgesetzt hat, seitens der Firma Bauer möchte ich in diesem Zusammenhang darauf hinweisen, dass unseres Erachtens die Firma Bauer die erste Wahl ist. And with the target and the objective that Abu Dhabi has set to improve the quality of air in the uh, Emirate of Abu Dhabi, of course, they had to come up with alternative. So they came up with to go to the uh, natural gas for vehicles. The natural gas has zero uh, monoxide and carbon dioxide emissions and hence is better for the environment. Natural gas is now becoming a, a requirement and uh, a necessary commodity for the community nowadays. And uh, we have achieved about 3,000 vehicles that are owned by the government. And the plans are to convert these as well as to go into the commercial as well as the private sector. And that is on the attempts of marketing, using natural gas uh, as fuel in vehicles, and the benefits that it comes to the environment, as well as the economical benefits, and that it returns uh, on, on as well the uh, consumers themselves, the vehicle owners. Of course, as I said, you know, our, our experience with power on phase one of 16 stations and <clears throat> already now we have awarded 
uh, phase two uh, to power as well for the uh, five more stations. And uh, the project uh, keeps uh, ongoing. And on the assessment, on the basis of the uh, uh, contractor evaluation, power has been on all uh, scales have been quite successful on implementing. And if we are asked to be of reference to power, we would definitely recommend them.